Thank you. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Please. <laughs> thank you. Book of the Day of Independence. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you very much. It, it's, uh, um, Madam President, Prime Minister, Prime Minister Berisha, and Deputy Prime Minister, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it's, a, it's really an enormous honor and, and privilege for me to be here with you this evening. Um, it's a particular privilege to be honored alongside Dick Holbrook, who is a remarkable man and a good friend of mine and a good friend of free people around the world. Um, when I look out and I see all of you here tonight, um, in the National Albanian American Council. I reflect on that time those years ago and the decisions that were taken. Hashim was actually mentioning I was back in Kosovo last year uh, with my wife Cherie. The only difficult moment of the visit was all those um, young boys called Tony Blair. This was... <laughs> um, she hadn't been warned about this and she was... Uh, there's a slight accusatory tone in the why are they all called Tony Blair? <laughs> um, but when I was there, I suddenly realized that a lot of these young people, that, the teenagers that I was meeting, would have been very young kids when the conflict began. And two things stand out for me from that time. The first was a meeting um, with Ibrahim Rugova in Downing Street. He was an extraordinary man, and he made an extraordinary and remarkable appeal to me. Um, this was 1998, I think. And he said to me, I want to give you a little gift. I want you to remember me and what I've said this evening, and I want you to remember my country by this gift. He said, it's not much, I'm not a rich man, this is not a rich country. But he gave me a little crystal. And he presented it to me. And he just shook my hand, he looked into my eyes, and he said, when you think of the times that are ahead, and you have to take decisions that are difficult, Remember me and what I told you about my people and how they deserve to be free. That's all I ask. <laughs>